even if I said to myself, that was a cracking piece of steak. So, and I did allow myself ooh, 40 whole minutes to sit down afterwards and let it go down a bit. So, right, okay, uh, just run Pixons to find out if my belt's in. Uh, there was a lot of ums and ahs, and uh, um, anybody know anything about this belt? I got a funny feeling no one ordered it, so it's not in. Tomorrow, I expect. So, anyway, so I got to now just drill the holes on these tabs so I can bolt this thing down tight. Um, I'm going to go into the barn and get the scribe. I'm going to set them up where I want them in here, and then I'm just, just going to scribe the holes from underneath so I know where I'm drilling. So, that makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah. a little bit about there I reckon one and draw some holes. Someone has hidden my sand punch. Set a punch. Okay, so we'll start with a small hole and work our way up. I uh, can't find my sand punch, but I'm hoping I can get in the middle. I've put a piece of timber underneath that I can brace on, so I can push down. And hopefully, that's going to work. Lines it with that one, and this one should line it with that one. It's tight, but it is in there. Maybe I can just I'm not gonna push pull the nut down on that. That will actually stop the whole thing from shaking and rattling around. 
So yeah, I'm not going to drill these out anymore. Um, that is tight in there, but I don't mind that. It's going to stop too much vibration. Okay, a bit of paint, I reckon, and we're done. This is the remains of the original, one of the original tabs that would have been on there. So, like I say, this, the steel is about the same thickness, but I'm kind of thinking that what I've done here should be stronger. Yeah, stronger. Uh, silver, have I got any black? that no no hmm. well it's black but I got more of that that's silver I'm gonna paint it silver Runny undercoat first. This isn't a cosmetic thing, this is a stop it rusting thing. I'm not worrying about that side. I don't want to cover the sticker up anyway. Just a bit on there though. Undercoat grey. Yeah, I can play about my guys leaving the workbench untidy. There's no point in encouraging them by doing it myself. Well, I think that's about it for today. I can't do anything else. Um, I'm not going to get the belt until tomorrow, so I can't put the machine back together again. So I think what's going to happen, I'll probably just let that dry for an hour or so out there. I'll put it all away under cover tonight. Um, the belt I can put on anywhere. I can do that down the shed or I can bring it back up here. But hopefully, if we get the belt back tomorrow, we can fit it back on the hedge trimmer and then we'll be good to go. Everything seems very peaceful down here. Bull's quite happy. He's there talking sweet nothings. Um, Yep, he's looking very tight down there. Peaceful. Just the way I like it. 
See, if I put this bale in there, they probably wouldn't eat it because this bale smells. It doesn't smell good. So I decided I wouldn't give this. This was going to go in for the cows and cows yesterday, but I decided not to because it didn't look, just didn't smell nice. But I thought just for an experiment, I'll stick it next to the feed barrier and see and see what happens. They're destroying it. So yeah. Obviously my nose is more sensitive than theirs. 